Hollywood Squares, starring Grant Stewart, Gilbert Gottfried, Mama, Eric Roberts, Melissa Peterman, Baritone, Lenny Clark. Appreciation Week on Hollywood Squares. I'll explain more about that in a moment. But first, the Wednesday audiences are always the best. The past six years, give yourselves a hand. So much better than Monday and Tuesday. Now, here's the deal. Uh, we, we haven't done this in six years. We thought we'd do it now. We're giving our staff a chance to be contestants so you can get a sense of, of some of the faces behind the scenes, the people who work really hard to get this show on the air week in and, and week out, and they're playing for their favorite charities as well. So uh, let's introduce today's contestants. In the circle position, the lovely and talented Paige Bennett. Yay! Welcome, Paige. Now, tell us about yourself and, uh, and, and what you do here. Uh, my name is Paige Bennett. I'm a hairstylist, and that's what I do here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, Growler, you'll have more time in your bio <laughs> than to go. Uh, and and uh, I should introduce that, like Kramer on Seinfeld, we only know him by one name. Please welcome Growler. <laughs> I'm a growler. I'm one of the handheld cameramen on the show, but I'm one of the six Emmy Award winning cameramen. I'd like to thank them all for being here. How's my head doing? It was very nice. Can I just, you know, as. as no, it's good. I just take them out. Can I ask you a favor? Sure. In six years, I've never seen you. You look like you're applying for a home loan. <laughs> Can you take the tie off during the commercial? Yeah, I thank you so much. All right. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thanks, Lisa. Yeah. All right. Sorry. Now, now, even though they're staff, they've been treated like contestants. Uh, they've they've been yelled at by Fern, uh, just like regular contestants, and uh, so they don't know any answers. And as you've seen earlier in the week, they barely know how to play the damn game. <laughs> But it's a best two out of three match of uh, tic-tac-toe, and whoever goes on to the bonus round has a shot at an additional $10,000 uh, for their charity, which is nice. Who won the coin toss backstage? I did. All right, Growler. Uh, let's get this over with. Penn and Teller. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Penn and Teller's baloney. Back for its second season on Showtime. In 2000, something from The Wizard of Oz sold at auction for $660,000. What? Six hundred sixty thousand. That would be uh, Judy Garland's designer pill collection. <laughs> uh, that's like the ruby slippers. It's easy. I'll give it to you. You were so kind to pick us first. Ruby slippers. Say agree. We're done. I agree. Of yeah, ruby slippers. That's yeah. right. How easy was that? X gets it. All right, Paige. Thank you for your trust. I am going to pick Eric Roberts. Eric Roberts, starring as Will Butler in Less Than Perfect on ABC Tuesdays. Eric. I know you wait for this. It's the Dr. Joyce Brothers question. Yeah. Oh, boy. Doctor? True or false, a woman is more likely than a man to blame problems on everybody but herself. Well, since a woman's asking me to define this for her, I'm going to blame the men and say no. I think guys do that. So you say, you say false, then? False. I agree. No, it's true. Women are, are likely to feel what happens depends on luck or the breaks uh, they got. So X gets it there, Grover. Well, wasn't my uh, Melissa Peterman, please. Melissa Peterman from Reba. Barbara Jean Hart, Fridays on the WB. <laughs> Melissa, in Cleveland, Ohio, yes. to legally trap a mouse, you reportedly need to have one of these. What? You need a hammer. <laughs> <laughs> A dustpan <laughs> and a way to distract the kids from the carnage. Um, <laughs> look, honey, Heather Locklear. <laughs> um, I think what they need to have, they have to have a live trap. You can't kill the mouse. Okay. 
I disagree. In Cleveland, Ohio, you have to have a hunting license. Oh. Legally, a hunting license. X, guess this what is the state bird? All right, Paige. I'm going to go with uh, Lenny. Lenny Clark. Uh, it's all relative. Okay. All right, Paige. Tuesday or Wednesdays on ABC. We're not sure when. It's somewhere. Yeah. In somewhere there. out there. All right. After many years, who split with her man and took up with Blaine, the Australian boogie boarder? My wife, thanks for bringing that up. <laughs> That's all right. I heard the shark season's coming up. Um, I think I read somewhere that was Joan Collins. Okay. I disagree. No, it's Barbie. She broke up with Ken. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's Barbie. Circle gets it. Roller. Uh, Mama for the win. Mama, starring in Vicki Lawrence and Mama, two woman show. Check out VickiLawrence.com for your day. For heaven's sake. <laughs> Rower, aren't you ashamed of the way you look? I I feel a little stiff. I, I guess do. so. I don't want to hear about your personal life. Yeah. Right. It is now believed that all of these evolved from one lone wolf, the East Asian wolf, most likely. All of what? That'd be all the dead chickens in my backyard. <laughs> You know, I, I believe that a wolf is responsible for the domestic dog as we know it, Growler. I believe you. Mama. And I Growler agree. wins this game. Yes, X gets it. It's the domestic dog. We'll be back with a secret square game and more of our staff members right after this. Promotional consideration furnished by the following.